trending sponsored copyright Getty internal White House documents spread by a top advisor to President Trump reportedly say that a manufacturing decline results in abortion and spousal abuse. The documents, obtained by the Washington Post, also allege that a weakened manufacturing base results in high divorce rate, increased drug opioid use and rising mortality rate. The documents were reportedly circulated by Peter Navarro, the director of the White House Office of Trade and Manufacturing Policy. Some White House officials have expressed concern to the Post about the documents, which are not supported by any data. We don't comment on purported internal documents, a White House official said. The president is working hard on behalf of the American people to make sure our trade agreements are free and fair and benefit the American worker, the official added. Navarro is reportedly in favor of Trump backing bilateral agreements, as opposed to agreements with more signatories, like the North American Free Trade Agreement NAFTA. The report comes amid Trump's repeated threats to pull out of NAFTA. U.S. Trade Representative Robert Lighthizer said Tuesday the Trump administration ISNT actively pursuing a withdrawal from the pact. He said the goal is to complete an update of the agreement. There is no active process for withdrawing, he said. There is no economic analysis as to what may happen should the deal fall apart, the Lighthizer said my guess is all three countries would do just fine. The latest round of negotiations highlighted the significant gaps remaining among the three North American trading partners. Discussions are now expected to stretch into 2018.